The triumph for NASA and America's return to the moon. The Orion spacecraft made a historic splashdown, returning to Earth, bringing an end to the program's first uncrewed test flight. The spacecraft sent back stunning images of the moon's surface and the view of the Earth from outer space. ABC's Joe Benitez covers transportation for us. Tonight, historic splashdown. Splashdown, the latest chapter of NASA's journey to the moon, comes to a close. Orion, back on Earth. After a record-breaking month-long trip around the moon, 270,000 miles from Earth, beaming back stunning images like this, selfies with the moon and Earth, and high-def close-ups of moon craters. The Orion spacecraft is barreling its way back home. Orion re-entered the atmosphere like a rock skipping on water. At 25,000 miles per hour, pushing through 5,000 degrees of heat, and the critical moment, successfully deploying those parachutes. There it is. High over the Pacific, America's new ticket to ride to the moon and beyond now in view. When humans yeah. do great things, we call them moonshots. And now our generation has a moonshot. It's a really exciting time. It was 50 years ago when American astronauts last stepped foot on the moon. Now America hopes to do it again to establish a base on the moon and around it for deep space exploration. How far do you hope Orion will go? Well, you know, I, I, Orion is a very important part of our overall transportation infrastructure. And certainly the moon is the first step. Hopefully there will be a lot more missions as we go forward beyond the moon. And Lindsay, Artemis 2 is scheduled to launch in 2024 with astronauts orbiting the moon. And Artemis 3 in 2025, putting the first woman and person of color on the surface of the moon. Lindsay. Going back up again more than 50 years later, Geo, our thanks to you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.